<laughs> Somebody make dubstep Nicolas Cage. Fuck right off. That's what we're coming into. That's what I, I look and there's this guy named Lyle of the Future and he said somebody make dubstep Nicolas Cage and I'm really not happy with that statement. I neither endorse nor oppose this. Are we even live? Fair. I think Fair. we're live, but Fair. most people are probably watching an ad. Um, an ad. So let's reward everybody who got ad block because they're the cool people. No, um... Well, they get banned. Fuck those guys. Forever. Fuck those kids. Fuck those faggots. Okay. This will never be on so, iTunes. <laughs> this is why we will never be on iTunes, and it's all your fault. I actually <laughs> got a uh, our first payment for a swag -a so that Dude. means that we've made a net profit of ten dollars off of this <laughs> podcast so far. Once you take into account the expenses of this song and um, the fucking you paid for this like song loop. Yeah. It's How royalty much? free. It was like forty, 40 bucks. Jeez. Just, wait, you're a fucking musician. You won't just make your own. Yeah, that but takes this is time some swag and effort. Here, so, anyway, if you're gonna um, host a podcast called Swagalag, and you should be able to make music. That well, I was gonna music introduce music us Swagalag. right there for the people that didn't know what this is, but for some reason, watch me. But um, <laughs> welcome to the Swaggle Egan podcast. <laughs> Uh, I'm Lyle. As always, we're here with Phil and <laughs> the man with the edible diction. Uh, Eat my yeah. diction one. There's a one at the end of that, right? Yep. Because fuck Microsoft. Cause... Because the really Wait, what? diction's a porn Twitter. No, uh, yeah, that's true, actually. <laughs> Is it really? <laughs> yeah, go look up Eat My Diction without the one on Twitter. It's a porn site. It's a so there's a porn site called Eat My Diction. I don't know if there's is it of, is it like really link. really like high class like literature porn. I don't know. People just like accidentally miss like at replied me a few times and they're like, oh shit! I just realized that this is not your Twitter and it's a Twitter for a porn site. I didn't click on their their like link or whatever because you know viruses and shit. But uh, it's it's their picture seems kind of classy. I'm, I'm trying to wrap my head around what that is. Maybe it's like some chick giving you the word of the day while she's getting it up the ass. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. But I'm actually kind of... Yeah, I remember... I remember, I remember like, a, like, I, like two years ago when I started my Twitter... I, I like I, I wanted it to just be eat my diction and I looked it up and it was some random dude in like Pennsylvania. Well like that random dude in Pennsylvania is now a porn mogul, so <laughs> Joke's on me, I guess. Yeah. You can put that in your dick and eat it. Smoke it. I can smoke things out of my dick. You can smoke you, it. Oh you got that uh that fucking hole put in. That second hole? Yep. Nice. I call it the chimney. <laughs> Yeah, see, I need but, to make YouTube money to even afford something like that. I had to just cauterize my own one in. You gotta do that through. fucking thing with that kitchen utensil. You know what I'm talking about. <laughs> I was actually trying to tell you before we started, I think we're gonna do the YouTube money skit this week because I I finally monetized my YouTube account, so now I have a reason to do shit. Oh, so, did you? Nice. Um, How did you manage that with, like, one video? They don't give a shit. I just took, like, they basically sat there and told me, like, oh, you can just press the monetize button and just go with it. I was like, all right, fuck the police. I but I, I don't know if that actually the... gives you money, though. I think it just makes it, I just think it's just monetized for YouTube. Well, no, I, no, I have to get an AdSense account, which I did. I'm, uh, I'm sure, I'm sure we'll be able to hook you up with something. If... Yeah, sooner or yeah, later. You, right. you got it. You got it. Once Jacob. I get the egg beater. In, yeah, well, well, that's called a business expense, son. Write that off on your taxes. Uh, especially where it's going. Anyways. And and cake mixer. An egg beater is just like a like a whisk. The cake mixer has the, the crank, I think. I'm gonna come at her with a fucking. Cause see what I'm thinking of is like a blender mixer hybrid. See, I'm thinking with like the crank, you're like slowly kind of going in. Like this as, is the as longest you... in, in joke I think we've ever gone through on Swagalagen, but whatever, moving on. <laughs> yeah, no one is going to understand what we're talking about. Speaking uh, of nobody understanding us when we talk, uh, dude, that fucking game of League. I... Are you 
When are you uploading it? I'm gonna fucking upload it this weekend. It's amazing, dude. But the thing about it is, is it's not like the other one. Like, I can't cut it. Because there are certain parts where it's literally, like... I'm not even joking, like, five minutes straight of just solid gold. And by solid <laughs> gold, I mean completely incomprehensible shit. Why don't you just upload that five minutes of solid gold? Uh, well, there are several different segments that are five minutes of solid gold. Basically, the whole video is like me and Phil, like, My name is Phil, and I am a big faggot. And it's just like, <laughs> we just get more and more incomprehensible into this weird-ass indescript accent. And by the fucking end of it, we're just like, you can't even understand what we're saying. I think, I think there was a section where I started screaming and like, just a Swedish accent. There's one part anything. where, um... Where I keep saying, uh, Trindemir, but I'm pronouncing it Trindemir. And I just, I get, like, I start out with, like, Trindemir. And by the end of it, I'm like, Trindemir. And it's, like, just so fucking, you can't, it's just, like, this fucking blur of noise. There are certain parts where we're talking over each other, and it's just, it's horrible. You're gonna hate it. So, that's coming this weekend for all of you people that hate yourselves. Diction's gonna laugh at it for like an ounce of a second and go, wait a minute, I hate League of Legends, and then fucking yeah, dislike the video. I hate League of Legends too, it's it's a great game. No you don't! That's the point of it, you're supposed to hate it, and everybody it's not like in it. Dark Souls or something. No, 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 it's not like Dark Souls, it's one of those games that you go on, and you're like surrounded by people who fucking suck, like, and then you get, <laughs> you get... With a friend, and you're like, look at this asshole, look at this fucking asshole, look, look, look at this doll, he, he's so mad. Like basically the meta game yeah it's like call of duty basically the meta game is you have to start each and every game or round with the idea that everyone else sucks and you have to call them out on it before they call you out on it that's it <laughs> well, that's all league of legends you about. don't even have it's to do that because most other fucking most of the time the <laughs> worst person on the team will blame everybody else and then like it, it, you have so much ammo on them Oh no, I went zero and nine, and I called I called our jungle out on his bullshit. And that was it. No one fucking referred to me. I lost the whole game. But it's always the jungle's fault, Phil. It is always the jungle's Especially fault. Especially when you're the fucking jungle. Fuck you. Fuck you and your Shivana. Shivana's not that good anymore. No. <clears throat> anyway, on uh <laughs> on the topic of less in shit, um, because we're everyone's gonna hate this. Uh I know we're not supposed to get into politics because that's borderlining on serious, but, um, <laughs> you hear there's gonna be, like, a fucking two-hour debate between Jon Stewart and Bill O'Reilly? Live? What does that have to do Wait, with what? politics? I yeah, mean, that's know, actually that a good point. Politics. I don't know what it has to do with politics, but what does it have to do with what we care about? I don't even... Oh, it doesn't have... Well, I, I don't think it's gonna, like, you know, shake the foundation of the political world. I just think it's I, gonna be I funny would, watching John Stewart watch called John Bill O'Reilly like, be a retard. Shit about Bill O'Reilly, yeah. Well, yeah, that's that's exactly it. John Stewart is fucking awesome when he's, like, just railing on someone. Yeah, but that's gonna be all it's, it, all it is, is John Stewart being all fucking Jewish and Bill O'Reilly screaming at him for two hours. And <laughs> it'll, it'll be really entertaining for like What's wrong with that? I, I think I could totally listen to two hours of Jew screaming. No, no. <laughs> I don't have, I, I don't have much of a life, Phil. I, I could fucking listen to whatever. <laughs> oh, God. This... This election has been, like, the worst fucking thing I think I've ever experienced in my life. I've had people delete me on Facebook and Twitter just because of my opinion. Literally. <laughs> I've, I've never I, had that's, that happen That's, before. honestly, that's, like, the, the like, that's the, uh, the thing with election years. It's, like, a Facebook filter. Like, you filter out all the assholes that you're friends with, and you don't have to talk to them again. <laughs> Dude, no, I, 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 I fucking... for Obama because I'm gay, and I said that's that's not really a good enough I vote. I don't want to <laughs> so... fucking even get into this election. I don't want to vote, and not just because Halo 4 comes out on the same day, but... Holy shit, does it? Yeah, it comes out oh. on fucking election day. Oh, fuck that, yeah, I'm gonna go play that instead. Yeah, exactly. No, this, this fucking election year is just so terrible, it, it's... Like... Because usually, when you elect in a Democrat, 
it's like you're taking a little bit of a chance that they're not going to completely fuck up everything. Like a very, very slight chance they're not going to completely fuck up everything. But then when they come into office and do jack shit, then you either keep the one that you know is going to do jack shit or elect in somebody who's going to be a complete fucking retard. So, so it's basically, like... basically what we're working with right now is Obama, who is both a complete and utter retard and does nothing, and Romney, who is Satan incarnate for the most part. He is so fu- I've, I've never seen one clip of Romney where he's not fucking dumb. Like, I, I've never, I've never seen one clip where, like, sometimes you'll see someone that you don't agree with and they at least, like, present themselves, like, eloquently and don't sound really fucking dumb. Every single clip of se- I've seen of Romney, he sounds fucking dumb with everything that he the, says. the funniest thing I heard was why he was really confused as to why airplane windows don't open. What? I said, no, he could find out. No, he could totally do it. Wait, he Someone said that he brought this up in the middle of a political debate. Like, Obama doesn't understand that airplane windows need to open because otherwise, how can you get air? <laughs> <laughs> There's no those long flights. What are you doing? Just recycling carbon dioxide? That's smart science. I just got this image of Romney just freaking, having a panic attack. Like, where's the air? He's a Mormon. <laughs> he doesn't believe in the atmosphere. <laughs> You ever see that video of Romney where he went up to uh, this gay, like this really old gay couple, but they did not look like a gay couple at all? He sat there and he's like, by the way, I hate gay people, so vote for me. Did and they like he's... bend each other over and start fucking each other in the ass right in front of them? That would have made that video ten times more interesting. I saw this well, one I... thing where some gay veteran like talks shit to his face. Yeah, yeah no, that's the exact same, it's the exact same thing. Yeah. Oh, man. Be an on turn gay, though. I don't get that. Whatever. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Moving bro. on to things that aren't politics. It's, what, what do we got to talk about? What movies are coming out? I, hey, uh, wait a minute. Hey, I, Looper, is it good? Because I, I know you God, said something so about good. it. I've, I've heard a lot of fucking good things about Looper. That reminds me. I've got to go that, see that. That really threw me off. time travel film since uh, Primer. And Primer is pretty goddamn good. As I a didn't really genre? think it was gonna be that good. I mean, it looked like one of those action movies you watch, and it's like, uh huh, it's fucking silly, like Resident <laughs> Evil Six, but whatever. And apparently, <laughs> everyone's all saying Resident absolute Evil movies. Good things. All... Oh, you mean the? Oh, you mean the video game, right? Oh, yeah. Resident Evil Six. Oh. Yes, I've been hearing nothing but amazing things about it. It's nothing <laughs> like the demo where it's fucking horrible, and I advise that everybody here goes out and buys it immediately without even uh, consulting a second source. You no, have my done. official endorsement, Resident Evil don't, 6. Don't, don't I, just got done. I just got done playing Resident Evil 6, and I I was like, there are no cheap deaths. I'm literally running through this whole thing by myself, and I'm in a, I'm in a fucking underground section where there's apparently trains still running, and one of the trains came up right behind me after she, she was middle of the warning. She goes, watch out, train, and I got hit by it. <laughs> And I was like, okay. That's and I sat there and I got the though. other track. I moved slightly towards the train. I wasn't even anywhere near it. It counted as a death. I said, are you fucking kidding me? I, so I was sitting there for 10 minutes trying to dodge this train, which apparently took the length of two train tracks in a small subway tunnel. I finally got past it only to get fucked right in the ass by a zombie. I hate this game already. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, uh, it's apparently terrible. Speaking of uh, terrible scene. media, I did um I did the spoilers ahead for Branded. That movie looks oh God. so fucking stupid. That fucking wrote itself, dude. It's so like, like I saw so, the trailer. Like, could you be a little more obvious about how corporate America is like like so, like our minds? When I do those, the only kind of like big challenge for me to make things funny is finding a way to like spin things like for example like prometheus where i kept bringing back like the vagina thing like making it seem like this sort of i don't even know because it was like this christian anti vagina i don't fucking but that that's like the main challenge there is just finding something that i i can spin so it's funnier that matches up and makes sense yeah but with that i mean i had the i had the russia thing that was pretty much it is that Russia's... There's one joke that uh, would have fit so fucking well, and I, I actually had it in there, but it broke the flow too much. 
and uh, it's where I say, um, I said he uses his one round that every Russian police officer is, you know, given. I was gonna add, like, they're also given one more for retirement or something like that, like, just implying, like, <laughs> they get two rounds total, one for service and one for retirement. But it, it broke the flow too much, and it, it keeps me up at night. It's like, should I have put that in? Should I have not put that in? And I, blooper reel. Do a blooper reel. <laughs> do a fucking spoilers ahead blooper reel. You know that 99% <laughs> of the time, that's all, like, first take shit, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah spoilers sure. ahead basically is him sitting in front of a fucking computer, either high, drunk, sleepy or a combination of all three and just I've, talking. I've and found just... that the best combination for that is to get really really tired and then um drink a lot. <laughs> <laughs> See, I've never considered doing like my bad advice videos drunk. I always do it like the morning of the of the day they go up. Sleep right, deprivation does a lot for oh, your oh, mindset. You I give you no idea. Fucked up Friday bad advice special right there. <laughs> Do it. Now that we've we've turned it into shit face Saturday, I have more time on Friday, so okay. <laughs> <laughs> because yeah. Renee went and got a fucking job. <laughs> What's that? You two money. You too money. <laughs> Let's all make pretentious noises, shall we? No quaint. That was nice. I like that. I got a, a, a cigar humidor. Yes. I'm gonna run a commercial so we make money. <laughs> so we make another cent. Yes. <laughs> yeah, every time I run one of those, it's like I, I think I make a dollar maybe. This month we're if that. Just play League of Legends footage in the background. Why? I fucking muted you. Why are you playing? I don't care about an Ibanez guitar. Fuck off. What are you talking I've got two Asian people with bagpipes eating Starburst on a bus. What? And a zombie. The fuck are you I have no fucking idea. I the can't hear it. So I have no idea. What it has to do with anything. What's what is your commercial, Lyle? I I don't <laughs> watch my own stream. How fucking arrogant and pretentious do you think I am? Uh a lot. The chat. Shut up, I don't have to listen to you. I'm better than you. Blocked and removed. <laughs> oh, okay, up. next. Oh I went there. Oh! Anyways. Oh! Oh. Uh, that was all you, buddy. That was all you. <laughs> Talk about Brickleberry. What do you want us to say about Brickleberry? It's going to be horrible. Wait, Everyone, is it out yet? Like, in the world is fucking complaining about Brickleberry. I need, I need to guess... know the tense. Is if it's out, then it's horrible. If it's going to be out, then it's going to be horrible. If it's already been canceled, then good. What is Brickleberry? Uh, Brickleberry, Brickleberry is basically Family Guy, as told by Daniel Tosh. I don't know if I want to see that. You don't. It's got bears I'm, in it. It'll actually well, probably depress you because. <laughs> I mean, I'm like, I'm okay with him making fun of viral videos, but that. that uh, dude, you, you don't don't watch it. Don't watch it. I've I've <laughs> I seen the. I don't have cable. So. Uh, the commercials were actually like so unfunny that it's offensive, and it looks like it's made in fucking Go Animate. All actually, the actually, that I, that I subscribed to on Twitter have basically cried out foul at Brickleberry being on TV. Yo, I've speaking never of seen uh, a group of people, like a community of people, just hate on something simultaneously. It, it look good. I'm actually very glad that that's being so negatively received because it's just awful. It it's. Oh my! Did you do you ever see the the original commercial where it's like the guy, like he's a what you call a park ranger? And he shoots two bears after like trying that's, to help them out. That's the commercial like, that I was like, and you had oh, this really pretentious guy go, yeah, it's that kind of cartoon. That's yeah, right. We're fuck super that ad. Edgy. Okay, there's this thing on a uh, college humor, and it's called Seth MacFarlane's Secret Formula, and I'm not even joking. Brickleberry seems like it came out of that cartoon. It's so bad. But uh, anyway, actually, speaking of fucking cartoons. 
Usually when someone's like, oh, this cartoon, it's on a kid's network, but it's not for kids, and you should watch it. Usually when people say that, they're full of shit. Like yeah. these people, they're like, oh yeah, My Little Pony's so deep with its fucking character. It's like, shut up, faggot. You're a 25-year-old <laughs> man. Unless you have a daughter, you've got no excuse. But uh, Adventure Time is actually... That show is awesome. It's actually yeah. legitimately good. I was fucking surprised. Like, I've, I've had it recommended to me. Um but by people who have terrible tastes in everything. So I never checked it out, but then I got it recommended to me by someone with an accent. So <laughs> that means that they automatically have some sort of intellectual validation. So I did check it out. And, uh, oh, by the way, oh, he's the same person that recommended that is the only person that's fucking listened to me and bought Spec Ops The Line. Which, fuck you. The well, only, actually, you know the only reason I haven't listened to you, because I don't need to buy it. But regardless, moving on. <laughs> right on. Not to mention, I, you know, was an idiot and joined this asshole stream at the last minute. Wait, did you play Addiction? the whole game spoiled for me. Well, it's not really a spoiler kind of thing. Like, it's not even about the plot. It's more about the experience. Yeah. I'd still check it out. It, it's something that really couldn't be anything other than a game. Like, it couldn't, you couldn't accomplish the same thing with, like, a movie. Nah, not really. And it's Someone... also, I, I love how mean that game is. Like, it makes you feel like shit, it calls out the industry on being shit, like, it's... It's got a very thin fourth wall, and it's just fucking mean. And I like yeah. that. I like that. It's gritty. It's, it's actually gritty. No, 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 no. I'm not saying it's gritty. If it was just gritty and dark, you know, you can get that from a bunch of other games. It's... It's mean to you, as a player. Like, it... It flat out says you're a little fucking cunt, pretty much. By the end of it, so you. So basically, what Uncharted Three tried to do but failed miserably at. Oh, what? Yeah, you didn't know that. What? Like the Uncharted... whole idea behind like them asking Drake, like, is it really worth it? Was they were trying to, you know, appeal to the player's sense of, man, are is it really worth it if you running around doing all these things, killing all these people? Like, what's the point? Like. Oh, is that was that the statement they were trying to make with that? Yeah, exactly. Exactly. I, d I didn't even get that from from that fuck. I I just thought it was the natural question, and if they didn't ask it at some point, I don't know. By the way, I love how his response was always, uh, "Yeah, <laughs> yeah, why, why not?" I I kind of I kind of when it when it did the same thing though when like there's like the building burning down and the dudes are still shooting at you and Drake's just like. Don't they fucking care that the building's falling down around them? Like, <laughs> it's sort of the same thing, so... I don't know. I Uncharted 3 is a lot of things, but I don't think it's that smartly written. There goes that fucking keyboard again. Yeah, someone's got a fucking Gatling gun. No, no, I, I, I don't, someone's firing off their Massachusetts up. typewriter in the fucking back room. Resident Evil 4 protect that Ashley Williams, otherwise fucking zombies drag her away, that's what's what. You don't even know. I get I don't it. Know what you're talking about, and I'm not going Resident to Evil answer. Four. That was the joke. I made a I made a super funny joke, and everybody should subscribe to my YouTube channel because of reference the game that everyone was playing. Now I'm looking at my Let's Play Part Three of Three. Super cool glitch Easter egg on the YouTube's. <laughs> you no, know, I think it's funny all that you on say this that. weird website called. YouTube. Called YouTube. And sometimes I'll speak with a funny Swedish accent. We like to get philosophical here on Swagalagon from time to time. This is not one of those times. Right now we're just making a lot of noise and hoping that it'll disorient you into laughter. That's uh... <laughs> basically the legal oh! game we were referring to earlier, right? What? The League of Legends game we were referring yeah. to earlier. Yeah. I if, swear if, to God, if I you remember, know which direction's just, up at the end of that, I don't think I've done my job right. Absolutely not. I barely remember that session myself. <laughs> Will you be doing another month you. of the empty wallet? I tried to no. All There's the nothing fucking games. coming out this November. It's fucking Halo and Call of Duty. What do you want me to do? Do you, do you want me to do a video where I compare Halo to Call of Duty and whichever one's better, and then I, I, I give my personal opinion, and then I beg for subscribers? Oh no, and likes. Gotta get the likes. Uh, you gotta like and subscribe. 
I remember it. Upload, okay, here's what you do. You upload two videos. One's the trailer for Black Ops. The other's the trailer for Halo 4. Don't do anything, any editing or commentary over those two. Just upload those. And then the third video, you talk about that. I'll, I'll call uh, Halo 4 campaign part for three. And then I'll, I'll play the Halo 4 campaign. And uh, I'll give my thoughts. Dishonored does come out uh, in like a week, just, doesn't it? I, does it? I just uh, ordered that while we were talking. Wait, is it actually that <laughs> close? That game looks... Fucking October sick. 10th. Yeah, next week. October 10th. Fuck, man. I I completely forgot that was a thing. Yeah, so did I. I mean, I one thing I keep hearing about that game is that it demos so terribly because of everything you can do. It's really hard to show people how the game works. Well, right. the yeah, so it, it kind of it kind of looks like uh, you got a bunch of different things that you can fucking whip out. And if you just dump that on people all at once, it's like rocket surgery. It's an assorted. Cool. It'd be, assorted it'd be like if I remember one time my friend was trying to get me to play WoW, and he's like, "No, no, dude, play my rogue character. It'll be super fun." And I, I like look at like the command board, and it's like this fucking. It, it looks like a. Uh, I can't think of the thing, a, a fucking like organ, like two fucking layers of all these icons that I don't even fucking recognize. He's like, oh yeah, you use decisive use strike to fucking take it's like, I don't I don't know what I'm pressing, dude. And that's why I play Guild Wars, because Guild Wars only has fucking five skills the whole goddamn game. That's your poor um yeah. Uh that What was that? What? What was that? What was that, Phil? What was that? What was that? What was that? Hold on. Maybe we hold our MMOs. To I, a I'm I'm holding like your half of the ten dollar net profit hostage. Thank you. Till you apologize. Fourteen percent PayPal takeout. You're gonna get yourself a very nice um four dollars and sixty eight cents. So real quick, yeah. somebody just Buy something posted nice. a link to this thing, and it says Hunter Spain Spain whatever the fuck. Three-year-old deaf boy told by preschool to change the way he signs his name. How do you tell a three-year-old deaf boy? Physically. <gasps> Duh. Physically. Yeah. Slap him around. He'll get the idea. You're not doing it right. Yeah, that's how they communicate, right? Like, what if someone's blind and deaf? How do you fucking communicate with that? You gotta slap him around. Pretty much, yeah. Exactly. That's how sense. I do it. Every time. But they're blind and deaf. Do they get the point after a while? Like, how do they... They do better! They yeah. <laughs> they're they're, they're, they're in, like, a, they a better. dark, silent box, and uh, all they feel is slapping. You know, they they <laughs> they find the correct stimulus response that doesn't result in slapping, and eventually, you know, it's, it's like a Skinner box, but with a so blind, they, deaf child. So the chat was talking about Helen Keller, and now I'm all, I'm, all I'm imagining is that movie about Helen Keller and, and the whole entire cast, just two hours of people slapping the shit out of Helen Keller. See, That's I'm I'm imagining fucking Helen Keller in, like, a, uh, a Skinner box trying to navigate a maze, and it's not going too well. <laughs> oh, she just fell over. Uh, oh, she's crying, or what we could perceive to be. Yeah, crying. yeah, she just kind of makes noise. <laughs> I wonder if anybody's like written out like a full like um Helen Keller phonetic alphabet. What? <laughs> <laughs> it's got to be I'm googling it. <laughs> no. Oh no. Did you hear about Helen Keller cutting Miley Cyrus's hair? What are what you even talking fuck? about? Isn't Miley Cyrus dead? <laughs> no, she just got a really bad haircut. She I... I guess uh, I was just projecting there. I fucking hate you. I just look down at the goddamn titles of all these videos. Why am I the fucking mascot? <laughs> you are the fucking mascot, bro. Fellatio Philosophy. Psych something with Phil in the title. Fuck you. <laughs> that was the one with uh, Zach, Psychic Pebbles. That's why it's got the psych. All right. All right. We got tef technical difficulties. We got the forbidden fruit. <laughs> I hate you. I know. I know, buddy. Uh, no one cares. Miley, Miley Cyrus looks like Butters off South Park. Is that what? What? <laughs> A little bit, yeah. <laughs>
I'm melted. sorry I'm not so up to date on Miley Cyrus's hair, guys. Well, get your shit together, man. Oh, yeah, okay, you want to talk pointless? Uh, fucking news? Oh god, an ad has company. intervened with my conversation. Um, you guys want to yeah, talk some really, pointless was... celebrity news? Did you hear that Justin Bieber throwed it up on stage? I watched it. it yeah. Was awesome. Vomit is what, by the far song? the best thing that's ever come out of Justin Bieber's mouth, I gotta say. Yep, and uh, the, the, the lip synced you know, uh, CD kept going when he was throwing up to <laughs> Yeah, that's the funniest thing, is <laughs> you can still hear Justin Bieber quote-unquote singing as he's throwing up. So either he's extremely talented. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man, I can't even joke about that. That's funny. So what, wait, was it that fucking retarded song where he's like, something about as long as you love me, so all you hear is the dubstep breakdown in the background, and he's just vomiting? Uh, my, <laughs> it, I'm not familiar I, with I just know, title. um, his baby and this other fucking terrible song that somebody makes me listen to. <laughs> you know, I can't slowed, believe she fucking listens. Down. Okay, in her defense, she only has one song, I think. Two. She's, she's telling me she's got two. I don't care. She quoted Dead Mouse on her Yay. Facebook and immediately Dead Mouse you know, Five. Said, Come on, Dead Mouse. Dead Mouse. She quoted Dead Mouse Five on her Facebook, and I was like, "All right, she can get away with the Justin Bieber." And you and I just, I swear to God, I heard you twitch a little bit from all what the way here. <laughs> just like, ah. <laughs> call, call me maybe. I don't think I'm gonna go on a limb here. I don't think Justin Bieber did that one. I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> just, <laughs> Sounds like her. Sounds. <laughs> And that Justin Bieber kid is hot. <laughs> yeah, she's a fine piece of ass, that Bieber girl. <laughs> that Bieber girl. <laughs> oh, God. Tory Bash, fuck off, J Dog. Tory Bash is like the best game ever. Have you. I've, I've played against people that are like black belts in that game. It is the most humiliating <laughs> shit in the world. Tory I've Bash is like. <laughs> oh, fuck. Wait, um. Wait, wait, Torbash is the one that you, like, uh, do, like, the different muscle spasms, right? Or is that the sumo yeah, one? Contracting yeah, contracting. Yeah. That shit is fucking hilarious. We did one, I did one with Chilled and Yutoric where there's a pendulum swinging, and you only have two turns to jump over the pendulum, and then it comes back, and you have to try to jump over it again. Oh, I, I I played it really early on, so it was just the fighting. But I played against Druox, and he fucking beat my ass so bad. Cause he he wasn't he wasn't like one of those insane people that never have seen the light of day, where he can fucking do like full on backflips and kick your head off. But he at least knew how to at least somewhat competently move his guy. And me, I was just fucking throwing myself into shit and just crap like that. There was once where I got this fucking crazy backflip judo kick thing and I like kicked his head in one direction and his body in the other one. I was pretty satisfied with that, but uh, yeah, that game is fun as hell. Most of the time though, just both people fall down immediately. Just try to much, kick yeah. at each other and they both flop over and it's kind of embarrassing. It usually turns into like just gay ass MMA wrestling. Yeah. Like, be like, okay, I'm just gonna grab your head and lay on you until I get more points, or you... And breathe softly, and breathe softly into your bosom. Breathe, whisper sweet nothings into your ear as I choke you out. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, sweetheart, after this I'll buy you a nice crab dinner. Oh, oh! <laughs> God damn it. Oh, oh, oh! Uh, speaking of movies, apparently Taken 2 comes out. <laughs> apparently it's got 7% on Rotten Tomatoes. Oh, well, okay, no, wait, is that- <laughs> that could be potentially what's happening to the user reviews for, like, Darksiders 2 and Resident Evil 6. No, so no, cult. Rotten Tomatoes is all based on, like, professional critics, which, granted, most of them are full of shit, but when it's at- okay, it's at 9% with- let's see how many reviews over there. 20, 20 rot reviews too fresh, and quite frankly... So basically what we're trying to say is, go see Taken 2. See Taken 2. In theaters two. this Friday. Go buy, go buy Resident Evil 6. <laughs> go buy Resident Evil 6. Um, yeah, Tabasco sauce and open wounds is great. And, um... And vaginas. 
Yes. Always put them in your vaginas. Yes. If you're a lady, Tabasco sauce is great to pour into your vagina. It is a wonderful herbal cleanse, and you will feel amazing. Right, gamer girl? Uh, she's, she's looking at me like that is not true. <laughs> something something is telling me that she's being disingenuous. <laughs> Hold on. <clears throat> no, you hold on, motherfucker. Fuck. No, we we wait for no man. Come on, Diction. You're the new Phil. Hi, I'm Phil. I listen to dubstep and I'm Vote for me on Facebook so I can be a dubstep. <laughs> Vote for me on <laughs> Facebook. <laughs> Look, y'all are just mad that I have dubstep with the best. You guys want to watch me dubstep on a dead mouse? I'll do it. You, dead mouse, five dubstepping. And, god damn it, Phil. I just, I just got this image of Skrillex jumping up and down on a dead mouse head. That's all I got. <laughs> you ever see the one where he's avoiding a bee? <laughs> <laughs> I'll show you. <laughs> You'll be out there. Dude, I I love when people are like deathly horrified of like some specific animal. That's the funniest thing. That's the, that's the greatest thing ever. Yeah, no, like, I'm uh, deathly horrified of <laughs> There's a dude who's uh who I know who's deathly horrified of uh moths. What? Yeah. Wait, Utoric. You, Utoric is I, afraid I can't of moths? Imagine, I can't even count the amount of times I've been in a fucking Skype call with him or get ready to record. He's like, oh, oh no, oh, that's a fucking moth in here. And he starts going. I can hear him like banging on his walls trying to kill it. I am not even joking when out of this guy's mouth has come, uh, you gotta kill it. Moths don't have a family. People care about them. Just, just go get rid of the moth. I don't, I don't- hold on real quick. I don't think I've seen anyone rock their head harder than Skrillex just did in that fucking gif. <laughs> <laughs> he literally went from, Hi right, Goth, what you doing? Ah! To like a fucking three second splat. Yeah, that's all I'm about for your neck points. Uh, Phil must curve. cream my cinnamon. Only if you ask me nicely. Hideo Kojima with the sombrero. I gotta see this. That uh, is yeah, I'm- That is Hideo that Kojima, is, that with, is the Hideo Kojima with the sombrero. Um, that link is ex exactly what it advertised. Uh, that is gonna be my new background. <laughs> this, uh, this speaking is... of Hideo Kojima, did you know that, uh, fucking ever since Silent Hill basically tanked, Konami is begging Hideo Kojima to do the next Silent Hill? Why? Like, exactly. <laughs> That's what I said, because I thought, you know, I thought the whole idea of, you know, playing Silent Hill was actually being able to play the game, not watch it. Yeah, so, I, I thought the point of Silent Hill was that there was a part where they're sitting on a ship four and a half hours, and then the main protagonist goes, ah, I never knew the sun could be so black! And then there's a subplot about some stupid bitch cooking eggs, and, and then the guy bleeds Nana white. Nano machines! Nano machines! That was, Nano machines! Yeah, there was a lot of nano machinery in that fucking game. Nano machines and fox dies. Fucking. The thing is, is I fucking skipped like most of those hairier scenes, and I still kind of. I'm not gonna lie and say I knew what was going on, but I wasn't I think, completely lost. I don't think Kojima even knew what was going on, and Metal Ground Zero doesn't look fun. Metal Ground, they... where the, the zero, the one with Raiden looks shit. <laughs> 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 I, yeah. I see. I don't know. A lot of people liked Raiden in Metal Gear Solid Four because he was actually badass. I didn't because I hate him. I hated him in Metal Gear Solid Two, like everybody else did. So in Metal Gear Solid Four, when they made him all badass, I was like, "That's the character that nobody fucking likes. I don't want to see him be badass." Well, he was. Yeah, they made him into a badass, and then he bleed, and then he bleeds cum, and I was like, "Yeah, that's about right." <laughs> yeah, he, he's a semen bleeding badass. <laughs> I, I I do like that scene though where he cuts off his own arm. That was that was pretty cool. Where he cuts off his own arm and then gets crushed by the giant fucking thing. I was just like, fuck yeah. Pretty much everything he does is cool. It's just because he's riding. Kinda oh like no Justin, no! I just Justin I just Bieber like to see him without an arm. 
I, <laughs> Justin Bieber will never be able to have a career because he's always going to be Justin Bieber. There's that he's... fucking there's that fucking scene at the end where he has no arms, and he's got his fucking sword in his mouth, and he's like fighting people. It's like, oh come on, seriously. Fucking DMC five video. Yeah, but everyone knows how we feel about the new DMC. Everyone at this point, because we bring it up almost every episode. <laughs> Devil uh, may run that. up on a nigga. Devil may run up on two niggas. What the Miles fuck ever Trump. happened to Chad Warden? Chad Warden. <laughs> he so made all bitches? that YouTube money in Pram. Yeah. That, that guy's awesome. Wherever he is. If you watch it again, though, it's like... It's so much more obvious that he's fucking with you. It really is. Because he's smiling the whole fucking time. Have you finished point? Okay, you know yeah, what? Yeah, yeah, he's like laughing through his fucking teeth the whole time. So, we got 20 minute lightning round? Yeah, you wanna do- yeah, let's uh, I'll run a fucking yeah, advertisement, well, and you little sounds cocksuckers sounds better have fucking questions for all of us, but mostly Phil. I don't even know what Nick's uh, doing right now, he's just typing. Everybody Imagine wants to be right. Phil, because Phil has the answer to all the questions, and that's your theme song. Uh, he's sick, guys. Mother that was Phil. I, uh, hold oh, on. Speaking of I speaking got answers to all the questions. Presidential debate or swagger lagger? Presidential debate. I vote Phil for president because I don't want to do the work. There you go. And <laughs> then we will make law vice, vice president and the Nick will be secretary of defense. I don't want to be fucking man. vice president. Vice president has to work if the president dies, and you're what? you're on the fast track to a heart attack, buddy. No, the way you no, fucking eat, fucking <laughs> saturated no, fats. No, exactly. Don't even look at the fucking warning label for eat. A, you know, do you even know what a serving is? Wait, you know there's no warning labels in foods, right? Yeah, you know, food. you know that a bag of Cheetos is actually two servings. And, and also, um, Iceland is very green, and Greenland is actually icy. So, I bet that's some trivia you, for you. Scientist over there? Yeah, I, I have many facts. In fact, did you know that a rhinoceros' horn is actually made of very strong fibers of hair? I can keep going if you guys are interested. Okay, I can... That I can- what pray tell do you wish of me, good sirs? I will give you the information that you seek, for I am Human Encyclopedia Extraordinaire 101. Then you will be known as Lyle Human Encyclopedia Captain Scientist Extraordinaire Man by- I Indeed I will, Phil, be such known as the It. Yes, the- uh, All hail the It. The, the oh, it is to be hailed by the many, for when many hail to it, the is because. No, see, Nick, you're wrong, because we don't hail the it, we hail the cage, because the cage is where the Nick is, Nicholas Cage, and that's who we hail. Fuck you. <laughs> Jesus Christ. That's fucking gay. What, are you gonna go watch Stolen, <clears throat> and then not get your money back? Yeah, watch, um, watch Abrasively Removed from Your Environment too. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> Like I was to Nick got it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't watch the cage movies, so I don't know. It's not a... <laughs> it was, it was, Phil, it was, yeah, that, that's yeah, no, the sound, it that's it the sound of hard. the joke, which was just put into the episode of Swag Lagging going over Phil's head. Because... Fuck you! It, <laughs> It's like, you're on the first floor of the apartment complex, we're telling jokes on the second one, you can kind of hear it through the cracks, but you don't know what we're saying. And then we have sex. Or aren't we supposed to do a lightning round? Uh, Let's do that. Let's get to that. I think the sirens are, are uh, initiating the lightning round. Um, who wants to start the, uh... Nick, you want to do the first lightning round? <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> Crash Bandicoot! Have you ever played the games? Uh, no. You, no, you, no, no, Phil, no, Phil, no. let's let's rescue this flaming shit heap that Nick fucked up. Wow! It's <clears throat> another lightning round. Lightning round. 
Ding, 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 ding. Okay. My friends and I are making a film about the horrors of swag. Have any ideas? What are we, your idea monitors? <laughs> yeah, we, we, uh, we, as the president, I say no. Uh, have you ever jerked off that much that you was no cum? Basically, your dick dry heaves. What? Yeah, that's <laughs> kind of possible. No, but close. So, <laughs> uh, I that dust came out. You're not even that old, though. <laughs> Apparently, you don't have to be. <laughs> My dick is constantly erect. What do I do? Brag about it. Lyle, will your girlfriend ever be on Swagalagon? <laughs> I mean, technically right now, she's background noise, I think, kind of, sometimes. Yeah, you. If someone wants to know if you'll ever be on Swagalagon. She'll listen. Currently discussing the <laughs> ethics of pots and us vaginas on Facebook with her. But whatever. Yeah. I mean, that, there's well, a lot of room for debate there. We're going to make another series <coughs> fucking Halo Machinima. Uh, only what? Nothing. If, Nothing. Only if... Are you arguing with your girlfriend? <laughs> Don't tell me what to do, bitch. I'll fucking kill you. And that wasn't talking to her. That was talking to you, Phil. Phil, when will daddy stop hitting you? When I stop liking it? <laughs> oh, that's pretty good. Um, how's that oh beard, Lyle? Why don't you mind your own business, oh, fucking weirdo? Hold on. Hey everybody, say hi to Sharon again. Fucking interrupting hi, on the pod. Sharon. Hey, hey Sharon, how's it going, like Sharon? Hashtag no. Occupy Phil's no. bitch. Uh, you're, you're. Can I call you back? Why are you gonna be on? <laughs> <laughs> have her on speakerphone. Uh, soon. No, no. Have your conversation. We'll wait. Yeah, no. Like, well, no, no. Go ahead. We'll wait. Yeah. Oh, wait I would be she, offended. I, I would be hold offended. On. What do I have? If you didn't. That's fucking gay. I'll talk to you later. Yeah, who needs real friends when you can have the internet? <laughs> <laughs> I make my friends out of doll hair. I I don't make you my friends. Of, my friends make doll me. Hairs. <laughs> Kill yourself. Fuck Please. you. Anyways, will you make a sequel to Proper Chief? How come nobody asks for a prequel to Proper Chief? Did I just blow your fucking mind, or did I just blow your fucking mind? Lyle, do you like Nirvana or the Gorillaz? Oh, uh, I, uh, I see both bands. I don't really like, but I respect um, the Gorillaz because they're interesting, and Nirvana because Kurt Cobain knew that Nirvana was fucking garbage and shot himself. So. I'm Kurt Cobain. He's just like, I'm an angel just in the ground. Then he put a fucking hole in his face. I can respect anybody who will put a fucking hole in Kurt Cobain's face, especially if it's Kurt this Cobain. This one's for Diction. How's Brett? Who, what? I killed him. Oh. You killed him? Nah, I'm oh. just fine. Fuck you for asking. Yeah, Why is the pinball machine in Duke Nukem so fucking hard? Why are you playing Duke Nukem? Yeah, what the hell? <laughs> That's dude. a better question. Have you no self-respect? <laughs> yeah, obviously not. Have you done porn with Misty yet? Not when his girlfriend's in the next room. No, no, no. Uh, no. Uh-uh. <laughs> no. <clears throat> How would a spoilers ahead <laughs> smart house go? It wouldn't. Borderlands 2 can only answer in fruit. Uh, white apple. Those are pretty cool. Diction, why do you look like a walrus? I had to ask that one calmly, like I'm concerned. Like, we're we're all worried about you. Why do you look like a walrus, Diction? Can someone Photoshop Diction being a walrus? Yeah, give him give him some give him some nice tusks. Be flattering. Be flattering. We don't want to be mean here on yeah, Flaggle Wagon. Nice Give this tusks. fucking useless, miserable cunt some nice goddamn tusks. Yeah. Otherwise, would you rather, would he'll you rather be jackets hurt. at My Little Pony? Yeah, that'll or... make it so fun when I finally get to eat out a girl again. Whoa, 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 whoa. 
There was a jacking it question. Um, go back right. to that. Wait, wait. Let, me, let me go back to it. Would you rather jack it to MLP, like My Little Pony porn, or get raped by Nicolas Cage and the Nega Ranger with razor blade laced penises? I don't think the second is possible because that'd be totally willing involvement. <laughs> <laughs> How many times can you say you got raped by Nicolas Cage? Yeah, Never. exactly. Never, exactly. because everybody wants to have sex with Nicolas Cage, right? Am I right, guys? You want to have sex with Nicolas Cage. You know you okay. do. Especially Love when those. his face is on some sort of cartoon character. Man, when he would do it. What? I wanted to wear the bear costume from the Wicker Man when we do it. And I wanted to you would. In the face. Uh, Lom Phil, who's pitching, who's catching? Little column A, little column B. Yeah, it's like Little League. You change every inning, and we're, we're children. Bazinga! <laughs> what do you think about Nickelback? Fuck you. I'm timing you out. That's what I think about Nickelback. Please. Roses are red. Phil's at Phil's like bitch is a whore. When Lyle gets hard, Phil's butt gets sore. Okay, that was a nice poem. I hope you know, <laughs> by the way, speaking of time people, about, I timed out everyone who made a fat joke in your stream yesterday. All for you, Nick! All for you! <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Are you guys having, like, a fat joke waging war? No, no. I was no. saying, like, as as fat people pry, someone, like, there was people calling him fat in his chat yesterday, and I timed them all out. And I was like, that's what you forever. get! Yeah, I did that. Too. You just got yelled. Phil. At. Yeah, that's kind of what he does. Oh, hold on. That's kind of what your boyfriend does all the time. <clears throat> dick sized nipples or nipple sized dicks? Wait, what the fuck is a dick sized nipple? That's a that dumb can be question. Because some dicks are different sizes, so I. Don't know. <clears throat> <laughs> Have you ever eaten out that chick? I don't. Can you? <laughs> I I mean it is higher you gotta, calories. You gotta snorkel because you got to lift up that flab and it's like resting on your head. There's not a whole lot of it. I mean, if Mitt Romney is concerned about air on airplanes, like there's even less. <laughs> I, I mean, mean the stomach of a fat chick. Okay? Yeah, if she's nice enough to get like a, a piercing for a snorkel hole, I mean, fuck it. I'm, I'm gonna, but, uh, is there a way we can send questions into the deb debate on Twitter? I want to ask Mitt Romney if he could open a window under a fat chick's fucking stomach. Wait, 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 was Romney a chubby chaser or something? Was, did I miss something? No, oh, God. Wow, another whoosh moment, this time for Lyle. I, I actually was not paying attention to you <laughs> for the first half of that. Ask ever be on Swaggalag, and if he answered his fucking phone! <laughs> yeah. But, uh, uh, don't take my word for it. What do you think, Jessica? You're not gonna... Cut off right there, are you? No. What? <laughs> no, no, not this time. I'll I'll find a better spot. Yeah, it's always gotta spot. be at the most awkward moment. That's when these end. <laughs> Is when they really shouldn't. So now we're gonna like try to make it awkward. No, no, no. I There's There's, there's no little drop. trying involved, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> it's oh, it's completely oh, effortless. What do you feel about that Lyle? Uh Deathcore? What the fuck is Deathcore? I... Exactly. I... I don't know. Are they talking about, like, the fucking kind of, uh... I don't think it's called Deathcore, but are they talking about, like, the shit where it's like, Oh, we're a metal band. Look at the cover of our fucking album where we're at a party drinking alcohol out of red plastic cups. Oh, we that's fucking Man dumb. Draw the album cover. Uh. <laughs> Basically, it sucks. Anyways, fairy tale, <laughs> Cowboy Bebop. Cowboy Bebop, because that's actually the only cool sounding one out of the fucking two. Dude, even if I didn't fucking like Cowboy Bebop, which I thought it was pretty damn good, uh, the seatbelts existing as a thing totally justifies Cowboy Bebop as a whole. That is the sickest soundtrack to Dude, it really ever. fucking is. Yeah. Like, <laughs> fuck yeah, man. Yeah, you got it. <laughs> fuck yeah. <laughs> but yeah, that's. Yes, I know it's called Tank. Fuck off. Lyle, say liquid. But liquid! I assume that's what he wanted. 
You sounded like you were gargling shit. Well, no, he wanted it like kind of. A, that's how Snake I mean, yells. He he does this weird like liquid, and it's, it doesn't really sound like the after the end of World War II, but it's it's kind of. I haven't done the fucking snake voice in so goddamn long, mainly because nobody talks like that. Boost road, uh, yeah, let's keep referencing a fucking game that no one even plays anymore. Hey guys, I play Skyrim, I, I just don't be... boost road on. I'm like you. Well, Phil, you're a king of my game. 13 year old Phil, <laughs> they're both alright. Adult Phil, no. Somehow fatter? Somehow fatter. <laughs> Lyle, your all. opinion really on Limp Bizkit and Linking Pork. Uh. Uh. I like pork. Fucking... I like Linking Pork. You like li you like Linking Pork? Sausage Link? Like yeah, I love that. Yeah, yeah <laughs> linking, linking Pork is a great, um, breakfast supplement. No, the way you're saying it makes <laughs> like an analogy for touching dicks. Yeah. You're linking... Well, Limp yeah. Bizkit is... And it's not even an analogy, it's just a misspelling of a fucking yeah. gay jerking off game. A circle jerk game. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> if Dixon and Phil belly bounce with each other, who would win? Would you ever see a foul? I'll tell you who would lose everybody watching. <laughs> you ever see a falcon punch in another falcon punch? It'd be kind of like that. <laughs> Would you Basically. watch pandas having? Would you watch pandas having sex? Yes, grammatically. I, have. I watched a panda poop on another panda's face. Whoa, whoa, whoa. they do that? There was like, it was a video like at a zoo, and this panda's just kind of like chilling underneath a log or like a tree, and another panda climbs on top of the tree, just kind of take one look, turns around, and just deuces right on top of the other panda, and that panda just kind of like looks confused for a second, and then starts licking it. It's probably the worst video of bears on the on the internet. Oh whoa! Uh, look at the time. I I totally gotta be somewhere uh, right now. Um, follow me on Twitter at Lime Douchebag. Follow Phil on Twitter at Philip Caldero One. Follow Diction on Twitter at Eat My Diction One. Uh, I'll see I'll see you guys later because urgent matter. <laughs>